we'll guide you through how to download and install the Microsoft 365 Office apps on your PC or laptop. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So what we need to do is go and open up a web browser. In this case, I'm using Google Chrome. You can choose one of yours though. And then all you need to do is go and search Microsoft 365 like this. Come to this top result here, office.com. And then what we need to do is go and click on sign in here or in the top right. And what you can do is if you don't already have a Microsoft account, you can click on create one. When you sign in, you'll get taken to a page like this. So you can actually go and use sort of like a free version of the Office apps in your web browser. But to go and download them, you need to go and buy Microsoft 365, which is essentially a subscription. So go to the top right and click on buy Microsoft 365. And then what you can do is choose a yearly or monthly subscription and you can go and purchase it. After you subscribed, you'll go and see the option in the top right, install apps. And what you can do is then go and click on that option. Now what's gonna happen is, is you need to go and download the Office setup file. As you can see, here it is, install Microsoft 365, choose a language and choose a version. I just keep these as they are, and you can then go and click on install at the bottom. Now you can come to the bottom of your computer and open up the file explorer, and you'll go and find the Office setup file. And all you need to do is double click on it and run it. You'll go and get a Windows security pop-up, and then this Microsoft pop-up saying we're getting things ready. Shortly, you should then go and get this pop-up saying, please stay online while Microsoft 365 and Office downloads. And the apps are now starting to download. So all you need to do is go and wait. After it's finished, the apps will be downloaded and installed. So you can click on search and we can start searching for them. For example, PowerPoint, Excel, Word. You get the idea they're all going to be installed. You can then go and open them up and start using them. You may be asked to go and sign in with your Microsoft account you just subscribed to Microsoft 365 with, but that's super simple. 